Hey everyone, Flawstruck here, and welcome to another Alicia Online update video. I hope your holiday was great and happy New Year's to you all. I came down sick the day after Christmas. I guess I can't complain since I rarely get sick, but this time I lost my voice for a couple days. I'm sure you can hear that I'm still having some problems with it. But I'm glad I can at least talk again, so I can make this video for you all. Oh yeah, the update. So you probably already saw the name of the video, and if you didn't bother to read it, then you must have seen the thumbnail. And if you didn't see that either, then... We have Pegasus Tack. It is not available in the shop. The only way to get this tack, for now, is to earn it from the stamp event. What's the stamp event? Well, every time you run a race, you earn a stamp, and after five races, you usually get a gift box. This is a limited time event for now, in celebration of the holiday, so it won't be around forever. These gift boxes are great. You can earn anything from carrots to gems, and now you can get the Pegasus tack from them too. The tack is temporary, as all tack is, and lasts only for one day. Each time you win the tack in a gift box, the expiration date is extended by one day. I hope I can get enough so I'll have it for the next couple of weeks. It's so beautiful! And very useful, too. In magic races, even when you are already holding a spell, the magic gauge will still continue to fill up, which is awesome. But there's nothing else in the update, so I'll introduce you to my three new horses I have. First, there's Holly. Thank you, Kinley Simpson, for the name suggestion. I bred Bell, who has the potential gifted runner, to glitch his horse, Iron Grip, who has the Iron Grip potential. It took four attempts before I got a potential from them. I've been leveling up Featherlight, but Holly has been having some bad luck with the number of points she's been earning. Next, there's Hito. His name was given to me by Athena Dolphinball, and yes, he's white. Here's the story. Today, I just had this random urge to breed. I tried breeding Ponyo to a Black Pinto two times, but I wasn't satisfied. Several people have mentioned that they've gotten a black horse from breeding with a white, so I thought I'd try that out next. My first attempt gave me Hito. Plus, he has the potential overprotective. Sadly, his stats aren't too good, but he'll be staying for quite a while. Last but not least is the black horse I've been wanting. Since Affen had such good luck breeding with the white horse, I figured I'd try a black. I had to buy another horse slot first. Can you believe I got him on my first try, which was pretty amazing. Yes, this is my second Traherne. I wanted to spell his name the same as my starter horse, and then I was going to change the starter's name, but they wouldn't let me use it. Oh well, that's fine. This is kind of how I pictured Churn, although the main tail and facial marking are all wrong. Still, I finally got my black horse. He also has a potential. This one is superior start. And he is benevolent, just like Affin is. And he also has really nice stats. I think he's supposed to be 206 or 207. Oh, and before I forget, let me put him up in breeding. I meant to actually... Oops, I'm going to have to get off of him. There we go. Also, something weird happened when I tried to play with him earlier. I said it was locked until his intimacy and cleanliness was higher. After I fed him a carrot, it unlocked. Have any of you encountered this? It's really weird. I mean, I already know I already said weird, but it, it really is weird. The final thing I want to mention is that I'm planning on trying to start another game for the channel. I know this has nothing to do with Alicia Online, I'm sorry. 
I won't go into too many details, but I'm running a poll to find out what you all would want to watch. My Twitter poll expired, but I did get a vote there. If you want to vote, you can do so by clicking the I at the top right and use my YouTube poll. You can also use the link to a poll I have in the description below. And on that one, you can actually add in any kind of games you want to into the whole voting thing. If you don't see something there you want to vote for. Or if you don't feel like messing with either one of those, you can just leave a comment below and I'll keep track of all of these votes. You don't have to choose a game in the list, like I said. You can just suggest any PC game. I don't have the equipment for doing console games at the moment. So yeah, if you know any other great PC games or anything like that, all suggestions will be considered. Thank you. That's it for today. As always, thanks for watching, and I hope to see you in the races. P.S. Sorry for my horrible voice. I'm trying so hard and I'm sure it should be back in a few more days.